No, just no, -uh. just let her do what she does. Let's see what she does. <clears throat> So this is a normal walk for you? Mm -hmm. Okay. Who told you to get the martingale? Um, You're just trying different things. I'm just trying different things because okay. I had the choke chain and okay. she was she was fairly at least trained on that. I mean she would stay beside me but then like I said, if there's a squirrel, she would bolt ahead or another dog, and I just felt like I was hurting her. Mm -hmm. So then I decided to mark Martin Yale. And I know the retractable leash is not good <laughs> I here. Make sure it's in the right position. Okay. And this walk, with the dead weight of your arm, you can control where she goes. And then if she does try to pull, just we're doing a little bit of little pop, just like this, mm -hmm. and say heel, heel, just like that. And uh, she responds very well. doesn't yeah. choke her at all, it's not restricting her breathing, it's just there in the right place. It's like it's like the AKC whenever they do like dog shows, yeah. they always want to put that they'd use a choke chain actually, uh -huh. but it's all the way up here where it needs to be okay. to control them really well. That's that's just the position wise, you need to be in the same position. And that might be another thing with her choke chain, it was cut if she's Yeah, it's down here. It was between yeah. sides almost, yeah. Yeah. That's where people go wrong with these too. Uh -huh. You know, they put it down here and it doesn't really do as much. It actually works against you. But in the right position, it just works so much well, better with you, for you. She's eh. falling on you as no. Well. You see the, the leash is relaxed. Yeah. I could actually, uh, if I go maybe two or three blocks just walking just like this, uh -huh. you'll be able to drop the leash. And that's how you work off of, uh, work okay. towards off leash but okay. I'll let you do it in a minute. Okay. Just want to make sure if there's something that does bolt, yeah. you know, let's see, we'll show you what to do. It's important that you say heel and kind of do the pop at the same time okay. so that she knows that what you want her to do is say is to heel okay. so that you know, we always want to work towards, the other thing is, we don't want to keep this collar on forever. Right. We want to work towards getting back to the flat collar. Okay. So if we use this consistently, then uh, that can happen. Okay. And that's the right side for her, that's not hurting her? No. Like pulling into her neck at all? I don't think so. Okay. She'd be able to, she'd be doing something. If it was uncomfortable for her. All right, let's stop. Wait. Big girl. Now it's now she's starting to say, "No, there's something different about my neck." That's okay. It's not hurting. Her. Well, see now. Watch her um, ears. If her ears get really perked up, you know that. You know that yeah, look. Kind of then you want to say heel right then because then you can catch it before it happens. Okay. Yeah. When you that's being proactive. When you yeah. when you hit when you see her posture up, remind her what she needs to do. Okay. Mm -hmm. So she's looking yeah. good. Exactly.
Nice work. Let's go straight. Let's go straight up around the block one more time. Because she's doing, she catches on so fast. I mean, I don't really have much else for you. <laughs> This is what you wanted, though, right? The fix? Yes, thank you. I do okay. Good. Nice. Very good. Yep, exactly. <laughs> 